Hi everyone, this is Bethany, BA Crafty Girl, and I just wanted to share a haul. Sorry I haven't been around this week because um, I was going to reply to people who had, re who had left comments on my thoughts and findings video, and then I was going to, you know, do a video with my mom, and, and then I ended up getting sick, and I'm still not feeling all that great, so, um, Sorry, I haven't replied. I will. And uh, um, I thought I'd show you a haul that came in. So uh, I ordered from Paper Tray Ink from the new release. And I was super surprised that it came because I didn't even get an email that it had shipped. So that was exciting. I picked up a whole bunch of CD cases for storage um, because I decided I was going to store my... Uh, my favorite things stamps and cases because the little packages were getting annoying to open and close open and close so I thought I'd store them in these and I was kind of excited because I thought on their blog it said that they were going to start carrying DVD cases like this so that you could store more stamps in one spot because they've changed their packaging but I looked and looked and looked and could not find the DVD cases on their website so I got the CD cases instead and then I ordered some new releases. I ordered, this is not a new release, this is from January new release. And it is called Flower Fusion 12. And it's super cute. It has a flower and then uh, button centers and some really great sentiments that I'm going to be using this week. And then I also got the die that goes with that. I don't know where it's at. But I did get the die that goes, there it is, that goes with it. And that cuts out the button center and that cuts out the flower. And I guess I could have gotten the stem one. I didn't even think about that. But got that. And then I got this. This is from the new release. It is flippin' adorable. And it's from a new line that's all about hearts, heart to heart. This is heart to heart number one, and I think it's going to end up being a set of 12, so one every month. And it's a coffee cup or a tea cup, travel cup, and then these little centers fit in the center. I love stamps that do that, they're like two-step stamping. And then these hearts fit into those hearts, so you can make the hearts a color. I think it's amazing. I like it a lot. And it says, and it has some great sentiments. Let's get together for girl talk, for tea, for coffee. I thought that was too cute not to get. And then I also got the little die that cuts out the travel mug. So I thought that was adorable. And then I got the, the index sheet for the flower. They've changed their packaging and stuff, and I tried to find an indexing sheet for the coffee cups one, and I could not find it. So I don't know if they're not doing that anymore. And then this is their new packaging. It's a skinnier box, which is nice, but it does, they don't come with CD cases anymore. And this is the whole DVD case thing that I was talking about. Like, it's supposed to fit in this DVD case that they're supposedly now selling, but I couldn't find it. Because I was totally going to get a DVD case for these, and I couldn't find it on the site. So, um, I got this one. It's called Sweet Spring. Oh, no, that's the... Yeah, it's called Sweet Spring, and I just thought it was cute. And then I also got the die that goes with it. it they had a Christmas one that also uses this same die so I picked that up that was a $15 set and the die wasn't very much and then I picked up another package of the coasters because it's only a dollar <laughs> and this is the awesomest part oh I'm so jazzed about this so I got this movers and shakers sentiment set from the new release and some really cute stuff that coordinates together. This is part of the new packaging that you get a new, or you get a indexing sheet so you can keep track of what you have, which is kind of cool. And then I got these dies to go with it. I'm so excited. They're like a zipper. 
and there's one that goes this way, and there's another one in there. It's a set of two. They were... $14. Sorry, I'm trying to open the dies up so I can show you. They're stuck in there. But they are so cool. Well, I'm not going to be able to get them out. So anyway, it you cut it out and then you line up where this line is going to be and you glue it down and then the recipient of your card can actually, you know, pull the tab to read what's underneath. That is so cool! If you go to the Paper Tray Ink blog, I believe that there is a tutorial-like video or a sample video that shows them actually making a card with this and then pulling the tab back. I thought that was amazing. I am so jazzed to make a card with this. Probably not today because I need to take a nap. <laughs> but um, if you want to see how this works, I'd be more than happy to do a video for you and uh, show how it works. So that was my order from Paper Tray Ink, and I'm going to try to reply to my uh, my previous video comments today. And uh, um, I'm going to also attempt to have my giveaway challenge video up this weekend too. So keep watching for that as well. So have a wonderful weekend, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!